Lightsaber reviews. Hello guys, this is Reaper here with another lightsaber review, and this is kind of different. I'm reviewing the Hasbro short lightsaber uh, for kids. It's a kid's toy. Uh, it cost it cost me around 30 bucks. Um, as you can tell, it is not like a replica. I mean, it is almost exact, but it's not like, you know, a replica replica. It is plastic, not metal, like uh, the other one. Um, it does take batteries, and the speaker is still done here but you don't unscrew this you have to you have a battery compartment to take out you can tell it's plastic because every time you handle it and move it it makes a noise you know like it's plasticky and then there's something in it that's broken apparently but it does have individual uh, light bulbs not like the replica fx one it does have individual light bulbs so you can see the going up and going down it does make more more kind of noise, better noises really when you move around in a sensor. The clash noises, it does have a better clash noise than the replica effects, but it blinks. And that's one thing I don't like because lightsabers don't blink. They give out light and they get brighter, they don't blink. So here it is. The, the humming sound to me is better. Let's get that. But the sound is so low, you can't, I don't know if you can hear it. Actually, where is the, yeah. There's the motion. Uh, I lie, they don't have better motion. But here's the clash. You have to hit it pretty hard now. So, I don't know if you can see the individual bulbs, but. But yeah, it's just real low. I mean, it's perfect for like beginners and it's really short. It's not long like a regular blade. It's like a, a sato, sato, whatever you want to call it. Short, short, sorry. But um, <clears throat> it's actually pretty awesome. My kid actually took it to Force and Leash too. So that was pretty awesome. Uh, all in all, it is actually great for like, if you want to get your kid a lightsaber, I would get the Hasbro plastic ones. Because once they break that, dude, those things cost a lot of money to replace. So, yeah, it's not bad. I mean, here it is in the, you know. It is not bad. It is not bad. The only problem is the sound. It's so low. The sensor is kind of like real sensitive and off. The clash, like I said, it blinks. I don't like that. It's a kid's toy. So thank you guys for watching my review that has a toy and I will see you guys next time. <laughs>